Last week I started creating a Naruto live action trailer. And after a lot of planning and 3 weeks of VFX work, we finished 2 shots from 66. So I better start creating the VFX shots much 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 faster if I want to finish the trailer in time. Because I only have until December 12th to finish the thing. But Alex, why do you put yourself in these impossible challenges? I don't know bro, I don't know, it's done! Yeah. Without... No, 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 oh, oh my god. <laughs> so, what do you need to do now? Oh, and by the way, this is Rational Jalex. He's always trying to help me solve my problems, rationally. Now I have to create the last five shots from the Madara scene. And what do you already have? I already have the paper armor I created the last video, and that's it. So, using my top tier equipments, I recorded all the shots that I needed, and the results were uh, questionable, but good enough for now. Not this one. This was the hardest to record and it wasn't working, but I'm gonna fix that later. And for this other shot, I didn't record anything, but you're gonna understand why later. I mean, removing the background was easy. I did it for all the shots and it was good to go. The problem is creating the desert background to put the shots in. Luckily, we have the old environment to use as reference. And the difference between the old and the new is basically just the camera position. So if I change the position of the elements on the shot, it should be enough to make this. Now I just put Madara back in and Madara is looking awful. So to make this look like it came from a movie and not from my smartphone recorded cheap paper cosplay using a USB light and lantern as the lights, we're gonna have to make a lot of changes. Bro, I don't think you can do it. This is Bad Jalex. He's the part of me which is always making me doubt myself. You know what? I'm tired of you coming here and telling me what I can and can't do. Who are you? Still, you can't. Especially in time. Right. So let's see what Blender has to say about that. Hello Jalex! This is Blender, the best free 3D software ever. He tries his best. Can you render this Madara I found online and retextured it? Yes, I can do it. Okay, so while we wait for the render, let me show you this game I've been playing. Raid Shadow Legend! What? No, seriously, hear me out. They have more than 600 champions, each one with different skills. My favorite ones are LA, super OP with a lot of area damage. Crusader has a lot of life and also does a lot of damage. And last but not least, War Priest. This is the best. She can freeze the enemy with her admonished skill and save me a lot of rounds. Your build is all wrong, Jalex. Bruh. As I was saying, this month, Ray just released a new feature, Awakening, and a brutal new dungeon, the Iron Twins Fortress. And if you can beat the Iron Twins, you can awaken your champions, which means that you can choose a powerful blessing to help you in, in battle. And there's a new champion! Death Knight, super dope and OP. And the best part, you can get him for free. You just have to log in and play Raid for 7 days between now and October 27. And use the DK Rises promo code to get a bunch of free items to level your new strongest champion all the way to level 50. What are you waiting for? Make sure to click in the link in the description or scan my QR code here to get an unique bonuses worth $30. Free app champions, Anya, 200k silver, one energy refill, XP boost, and ancient shard. Thank you, Raid Shadow Legends, for sponsoring this video. It's done. Now I just put this on top of my video using After Effects, and it's done. Bam, bam, bam. Whatever. It's still super late. <sighs> He's right. I'm super late. Fuck. Put 3D ninjas on the background, some dust particles and sand on the air, adjust the falling animation speed, animate the camera and that's it. Start rendering, wait, sleep on the chair, render finished, it's done. Go to the next shot, take Madara out, zoom in, put a hand, start rendering, sleep on the chair, wake up, watch the final renders, spot some mistakes and hope no one else does. Consider the shots done, appreciate what you did for 3 seconds. Good enough. And about the reaction shot, my friend's gonna help me with that. Hello? Hey Chris! Chalex! Can you record a video looking up with a very afraid expression for me? Yeah, sure, I can do that. Um, can I wear my yordress? No, Chris. You're supposed to be a shinobi. <laughs>
All right, fine, yeah, sure, I'll change. Now I have a lot of options. I just gotta duplicate, duplicate, duplicate. Make the sound come from behind, the environment, the smokes, and make the camera move, and that's it. Now I'm gonna show it to him. Here it comes. <laughs> Damn, this looks really good. I felt amazing. That's progress. Yeah, I mean, I didn't think I could do it, you know. But then Chris recorded the videos and sent me, and I was super hyped, and then I added everything to Yeah, I mean, I'm finally starting to feel proud of myself. I was thinking and looking at those two shots on the wall. And if I remember correctly, that means that you didn't finish them. And that's where you are wrong. My friend. I messed up the recording of the feed shot. Yes. What are you gonna do? Sue me. And then I went above and beyond my big brain idea, and that's why I recorded everything again using technology. technology. With the treadmill plus my acting skills, I just needed to adjust the speed of the shot so I would run faster. Match the speed with the 3D ground and make the 3D ground move in sync with my running speed. Then I rendered it using Blender. Then I put everything together with some more stuff and that was finished. And what about the Madara? I mean, Madara shot was my masterpiece. First things first, makeup, make me look fabulous and more like Madara. Clean the skin, make the scars look better, make the face a bit more angry and... Wow, there's no way this is gonna look good. But these eyes are looking awful, so I just delete them, then recreate them and animate them so they move correctly. Yeah, but the hair still looks like Shut shit. Up. I knew you would talk about the hair. 3D hair! Animated the 3D sphere to follow the head, then creating the hair system with the Madara style and simulating the physics, then adjusting the shading and compositing everything together. And this was the result. Bro, sit down, be humble, and watch the final 